Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have another Boost box to open. We are going to open up the Pure Boost X Trainer 3.0. Adidas just dropped a few new designs of the Pure Boost and the Ultra Boost, and we are going to open this box right here today. Before we start, I would like to thank you guys for all the support you've been showing me in my past unboxing videos. Thank you for liking, thank you for commenting, I've gotten a lot of positive feedback on all those unboxing videos, and I have you guys to thank, so this one right here is for you. Let's open up the Pure Boost X Trainer 3.0. Same thing, we're going to talk about three things. Let's talk about how it looks, the main features, and of course, how much this thing costs. So first of all, let me show you guys the brand new Pure Boost X Trainer 3.0. Just giving you a quick look. Showing you the pair. And both of them together, of course. Really, really nice. So, let's make this one quick. Let's talk about all the features that this shoe has to offer. So, first of all, this one, as you've already, as we've already talked about, Boost is the most responsive cushioning design that Adidas has. So that's this over here. If you haven't gotten your pair of Pure Boosts yet, that is the cushioning system that you have at the sole of this shoe. The or the more the energy you give, the more you get out of it, and that's what makes this design so beautiful. As you can see here on the upper part of the shoe. They've reinvented the design completely. It looks different from the past releases of the Pure Boost. The knit upper with energized zones for adaptive fit and premium naturals. You see the logo, the embossed logo over here. You got that classic series stripe right there. And of course, that floating arch, which makes all the difference when it comes to your foot strike and that overall feeling when you are running. So, the big question is, what makes this shoe different from all the other releases of the Pure Boost? So, this one right here is the Pure Boost X 3.0. What really makes it different compared to the other releases of the Pure Boost? So, first of all, the design of this shoe was really made for the urban athlete. That means that this was designed for those who are running in the city, those who are running on pavement, on cement ground, to make sure that they get the best experience. Because here in the Philippines, that's the majority of the runners that you get. We are in a concrete jungle here in Manila, so we need a shoe that will cater to just that. If you notice this, you will see how this base, the sole, is a little bit thinner. So that means that the runner has been brought closer to the ground to be able to adapt to changes in foot strike, changes in direction if you're running on pavement or you're running on um, a sidewalk so that you can adjust your movement depending on the need. So that makes this shoe more adaptable, this shoe more efficient when it comes to running in the city, something that's very important if you're living here in the Philippines. Also, you'll see that the shoe is very, very flexible. Um, this flexible shoe is great for long runs, for sprints, something that I am really happy about all the Adidas shoes that we've had all the ones that we've covered they're all very very flexible something that's really really good especially if you like training a lot lastly let's talk about the price point right here you can see the price in peso of the pure boost x trainer it's seven thousand pesos so that's around 
150 US dollars. So I am a size four and a half. You can get this in stores. That's how it usually runs. But also you can order this from the online shop, which is where you can get your brand new Pure Boost X trainers. 3.0 so that's it for this video if there's anything that you guys would like to know more about do hit me in the comments let me know what you want to hear more in this channel so that i can cover it leave me a thumbs up and if you like this video don't forget to share it subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet that's it for today thank you guys for watching bye till the next time